Marie Schrader's cameo was originally intended for Better Call Saul, but fortunately it ended up being used in the show's finale, leading to a brilliant conclusion. Better Call Saul's season finale had a surprise appearance from Marie that wasn't originally supposed to happen, and the original plan would have ruined the climax. And left a hole in the desert. The Breaking Bad spin-off received rave accolades for both its writing and performance during its successful run on AMC. The series concluded after six seasons with the acclaimed final episode. It's not surprising that the Better Call Saul ending was bittersweet, as the show deals with a sleazy, cold-hearted criminal who viewers have come to know as Saul Goodman. In its final episode, the series features a surprise cameo from Marie Schrader, a character from Breaking Bad. Marie, widowed and rightfully angry at the death of her husband, appears as a witness against Saul Goodman in court after he is finally arrested for his crimes. Saul does what he knows best and lies in court, spinning a narrative that he was afraid of Walter White and that he only took part in his drug crimes out of fear. Marie leaves after hearing that the prosecutor believes his story and cuts his sentence down to a quick and easy seven years in prison instead of a life sentence. In the end, Saul Goodman finally tells the truth and reveals that his involvement in his crimes were due to his own personal greed. With one painfully honest speech in court later, Saul is given 86 years in prison, where he will live out the rest of his life. Marie was present during his final confession, reminding Saul of the damage he, Walter White and others caused. The original plan for Marie's cameo in Better Call Saul was going to take place all the way back in season two, however. Season 2 discussed Saul's whereabouts before he became the scheming lawyer he was in Breaking Bad, back when he was known by his actual name Jimmy McGill. Writing in Marie's character would have been extremely difficult to do and wouldn't have really been worth it. If she had had a cameo in Season 2, then she would have been absent from the Better Call Saul ending, which would have ultimately been to the finale's detriment. They tell me they found you in a garbage dumpster. Why Marie Schrader's Better Call Saul finale cameo was perfect, since her appearance in the first few seasons of Breaking Bad, Marie has experienced a lot. She was Hank, a D-agent, and Walter White's kleptomaniacal sister-in-law. The couple had a close relationship with Walter and his family, so learning of Walter's drug-related charges hurt them. Hank decided to pursue Walter after learning about his involvement, but was ultimately assassinated by Jack Welker. It was crucial that Marie Schrader appeared in the season finale of Better Call Saul. Both Saul and the audience found it moving and gut-wrenching to witness how the agony she had experienced had altered her. The amazing conclusion of Better Call Saul was made possible in part by Marie's cameo. All good things must come to the end, and the same applies to Better Call Saul. It was great to see loose ends tied up and two witness characters change and grow. The end of the series marks an unfortunate end to the Breaking Bad universe, though there is some slight hope that TV might return to the world of Saul Goodman and Walter White in the future.